Merle's Inlet. Now, Bike Week has become a tradition for many people I spoke with. They tell me that the best part is meeting people from all different walks of life. It's Bike Week, baby! Bike Week is back. Thousands of bikers making their way to Merle's Inlet to celebrate. We've met people from South Dakota, South Florida. We've met people from the West Coast. It's Ed Pinero's second time at Bike Week. He and his wife grabbed a drink at the Beaver Bar after driving 13 hours from Missouri. There was a little rain on the way up. This is Kathy and Don Brown's first time at the Spring Rally. They usually go to the one in Atlantic Beach, but decided to try something new. It never gets dull. There's never a dull moment. Just meeting people and exploring different different places. So I, I love it. Bars and restaurants along Business 17 prepare and stock up. Patrick Zarcone, a bartender at Captain Jimmy's Inlet Crab House, says it's all hands on deck for Bike Week. It gets a little crazy, you know. It gets really busy, especially at nighttime, you know. So. Everyone from all over the country is coming here to see all the bikes. Vendors set up shop and parking lots. One of those is DNA Specialty, which makes custom rims. They've been to hundreds of bike events, but this is their first on the Grand Strand. Well, seeing the culture, seeing the, the bikes, seeing all the custom stuff. So we think it's amazing to be here and uh, we're, we're really excited. Now that area is only only expected to get more packed as the week continues. There are plenty of Georgetown County deputies, Horry County police officers, and state troopers in this area, making sure that this week is safe on top of being fun. Andrew? Joel, thank you. Now we have a list of the spring rally events taking place. Just go over to WPD.com and search Bike Week.